Hello and welcome back to another video. I'm so excited to share with you my bullet journal 2021 setup and it's quite too late to show you this video due to our schedule. We've just moved into our rental house and decluttering and organizing random stuff took a while to set up. However, I finally made a video that I planned a few weeks ago. I hope you will stay with me till the end of this video to show you my simple journal design and some layout for my spreads. If you are interested in this video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and click the notification bell to get more updates. Hello and welcome back to my channel. So here's my new vintage journal notebook that I got from AliExpress and I will link down in the description box below all the items that I used. So this notebook is quite smaller but enough for me and I love the vintage style. To start with, this is the front page of my January bullet journal for this year. And I decided to make a vintage style. It incorporated the design of the notebook and I started my bullet journal last September 2020 and it's quite helpful to track my schedule. I used a washi tape that I got from AliExpress, some vintage stickers from Japan. I want this from a giveaway and these stickers are a French vintage style. So it has a gold foil and this is a washi stickers. This washi tape is from AliExpress and it's a vintage style and the size is a little bit wider, perfect for any project. And the next one is the world map washi tape and it's also from AliExpress and I really love the size and the design. I also use a clear stamp from our local store and I use this banner for my front page and this is from Craft Sensation Company. Moving to our next spread, uh, this is the 2021 calendar and I use a clear stamp from AliExpress and all the days, the date and even the backs of the calendar but the other clear stamp for the month and the days is from our local store here. I added a white gel from Pentel Company that I got from our local bookstore and this is to add some accent. So the next spread is my January sheet and if you noticed I stamp random keys and over stamp. I choose this theme because it reminds me that this month we got our keys in our rental house and I use a clear stamp from Craft Sensation. I got this from our local store. On the right page is my weekly overview. So for the tag, I use a clear stamp from Craft Sensation that I got from our local store. Then I added some washi tapes from AliExpress and again, I will link all the materials that I use in this journal. So here's the washi tape. It comes with this cute box. And this little flower is from AliExpress and you will get random cards in this pack. Mm -hmm. 
This is my second week spread and I made a banner style but in a horizontal position. Then I added some designs with some cards, stickers, and washi tapes. Then on the third weekly spread, it's just a traditional spread. Then I added some washi tapes and I used a black pen and white gel for the date. In this page, I made this alternate date or design and it's traditional spread to make it simple. Then in the next is it's still the same design on my previous spread and I added some washi tapes and stickers. So this is a floral design. This is not a sticker and I got this from Aliexpress. I just fussy cut and I stick to my journal. Next is my weekly cleaning routine. I added some floral designs from this cute pad from Aliexpress. Then from Monday, I have a schedule of cleaning in some part of the house. Then Tuesday, Wednesday, and so on. But on Sunday, it will be our relaxed day depending on how we clutter our house. And my husband, he used to help me in cleaning the house. Next is the monthly cleaning routine. So I decorated it with flora and washi tapes. And for the label, I cut a piece of black paper, then I use a white gel for the label. For my reminder spread, I do the same in another spread. I decorated it with flora and washi tapes. Let's move on to my expenses. So this month, we spent a lot of it because we've just moved in and we need to purchase some essential that we don't have. But I make sure to save some penny for this month and this is my yearly savings spread. My wish list I track all the stuff that we need to buy for the future need but only the important or the essential this is the last spread for January and I stamped it with this lady riding on the horse then I added some embellishments like cards stickers washi tapes and floral I will show you some stickers that I get from Aliexpress so these are the stickers that I used and these are some random washi tapes that I got from Aliexpress and from Japan. These are the random tapes, a vintage and etc. That's all for today's video. Again, I apologize for the delay in my January spread. And if you are interested in this journal, please don't forget to subscribe, hit the like button, share this video, and comment down below which one is your favorite spread. Thank you so much for supporting my small channel and I hope you will stay with me in my YouTube journey. Keep safe everyone! Thanks for watching and see you next time. Bye!